Welcome to Tips and Tricks. Today I'd like to show you a way to scan your local area network and be able to see all the IP addresses on the network and all the devices on the network. And I'm going to show you two ways. One way is a free way using the command line tool that's built right into all of the Mac OS X uh, operating systems. Uh, and the other way is actually a, a paid app, but one that I find really, really useful. Um, both of them give uh, the same kind of scan information, but you can get a little bit deeper with the app because it has a graphic user interface. Um, but let's start with the uh, command line way. If we open up terminal and just type in ARP space dash A and then hit return. And we'll get an immediate scan of the network. And it shows us each device on the network and their IP number. So this is a good way to see, for one, how many devices are on your network at any time um, and what IP address has been assigned to them. Uh, especially, let's say you want to add a new device to your network um, and you want to make sure that it's the IP address you want to give it is not going to conflict with an IP address that's already on the network. This is a good way to do a quick check uh, or even just to see, you know, are there unexpected devices on the network uh, and where are they? Now it also shows the MAC address. Well, it doesn't mean MAC as in Macintosh. This is a MAC address and this is a unique address that is assigned to every uh, Ethernet or network uh, device on the network. So whether it's um, wired in Ethernet or Wi-Fi, it'll show this uh, address here. And then it shows what uh, interface um, we can see the device from. So this is the uh, Ethernet interface of the particular device that we're on right now. So in this case, this laptop. So this is a good, good quick way to do that. Totally free and a nice way to uh, look at conf uh, conflicts on your network. Now another way is an application that I've really been using a lot over the years and I'll just show it to you in the App Store quickly if we do a search here on iNet. There's a bunch of different um, applications that do these types of things but uh, this is one that's been particular handy for me so the price is really not bad it's it's you know $25 or less depending on what country you're in and I found out it, it works uh, you know, really reliably um, uh, there's a version actually for iOS so it can run on your iPad or your iPhone as well. And I'll just pop it open quickly so that we can see it. Well this one here you can scan the network for so your LAN so it can be anything that's on your Wi-Fi or your wired network. Um, anything that's on the Bonjour network advertising itself over the network. And through this one, we can see the throughput on our wireless devices on the network, so our Wi-Fi hotspots. So in this case, I'm looking at our office at Airport Extreme, and you can actually see the traffic coming in and out, and so on. And it can show all the scans that we've uh, that we've done recently as well. So let me go back here. Uh, this is sort of our main one. If we hit scan. And it actually goes in and actively scans the network that you're on. So I use this all the time, uh, either to troubleshoot things in our own office, but actually more often when I'm going out to clients and we need to look at uh, what devices are on the network and so on. So like the ARP command, it gives us um, the device and its IP address. And we also get the MAC address here as well, so our IP address or MAC address. But we get a lot more information also. Uh, we get the, uh, the manufacturer of the device, in most cases, and even the, the type of device. So you can see an airport, a Mac Mini, Airport Express, laptops. Uh, this will be an older Mac uh, where the uh, manufacturer stuff is, is, is hidden, Apple TVs, desktop units, and so on. So we get a ton of information actually. And on each device as well, if we look at say this one here, which is a server, you can see we can scan for the ports that are open and so on. So it's a really, really handy tool. I've been finding it uh, really useful. Um, now, I, I'm not being paid by the guys that uh, develop this. I'm not even sure who the developers are, but I found uh, it was actually money well spent for, uh, for what it does. 
So I just want to show you a, a quick view into two ways to scan the network, a free way uh, using the command line and a paid way using a graphical user interface uh, application. So I hope you enjoy this video and I hope it's useful for you. I hope these uh, tools come in handy for you uh, when you're doing any kind of troubleshooting on, on your network. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel. We'll be coming up with more videos all the time. Uh, if you like it too, please share it with people um, and put a comment down uh, in the comment section below if you have any suggestions on other topics that we can do that would be helpful for you. Thanks for watching. Thank you.